The Ubers in Ghana are horrible. This don't make no sense. Nobody no knows sense. how to drive around here. <laughs> I used to sleep easy You never hesitate to make it known that you ain't never needed me I lost my appetite for love, I throw it up, you must be too queasy yeah. I know I'm better off alone, I finally realized that you're seeing me Just what you're seeing in me uh. You let my love just expire You set my feelings on fire You'll never find a bitch flyer You might as well just retire You just expected me to lie down And let you walk over me somehow And now I have no desire To lay in bed with a liar Yeah, the way I lie on me Oh, you put your life on me, yeah Keeping your right on me Don't wanna fight for me, yeah You might just pull a knife on me Never die for me, yeah Do you lie for me? You lie for me, yeah Hey guys, so um, we went to Coco Lounge to celebrate um, Annette's birthday uh, She's a PhD student at my school and she's also here this summer doing research So um, the food was pretty good, the service wasn't too good um, on the way there, oh my gosh, Uber let us down. For some reason, like all the drivers have trouble locating the Dean's guest house, which is where we're at. But I mean, if you look on the map, it's pretty much straightforward how to get here. And so yesterday we requested the Uber and I was seeing that, you know, it was just taking a while to find where we were. So I called him, asked if he was lost. And he said, you know, yeah, I am lost. How do I locate y'all? So I was telling him, you know, just follow the map and I was giving him my like turn by turn directions and I'm like, you know, if you can't find it, just go ahead and cancel the ride. It's okay, we'll find another Uber. The driver refused to cancel the ride, so he was literally just driving around for 20 minutes trying to locate us. And if I cancel the ride on the app, then Uber charges you. So eventually we just left and we found a taxi and he did end up um, canceling the ride eventually. But today we have the day off, so um, we're going to the beach. Um, the project is moving along. We've done um, Eliza on 80 samples so far, and Eliza is just determining the method for determining the protein levels. I had no idea how long that took. It was like a 12, almost like a 10 hour day in the lab. It was a pretty long day. It was a lot of, you know, pipetting and then just sitting for hours and waiting for the next step pretty much and then later in the week we have to go to like a different hospital to get um like more samples more blood samples from malaria patients so so far so good today is a nice day and we're just gonna head out to bojo beach mm, yeah Okay, this is how we do it. Pull up and we kill them on arrival. That's a drive by. Call a Uber because we lit. And you know it's pretty as we staying all the way on the west side. That's the best side. It's you to come through if you with it. Once I put you on, you won't forget it, boy. Let me show you just what you've been missing. On, on and on and on and on. We ain't going home till the night turns into morning. Nothing wrong. Bored up, I'm trying to live a little. Live a little. Ain't turning down, not even just a little. Just a I might little. be rolling with you, baby, in a little. Top down on the coop, wanna feel a little, live a little. Bored up, I'm trying to live a little. Live a little. Ain't turning down, not even just a little. Just a I might little. be rolling with you, baby, in a little. Top down on the coop, when we live a little, live a little. I'm feeling myself. The DJ being reckless, cause he knows damn well. That you can't tell me nothing when I'm on a rose. Eh? No, you can't tell me nothing, fuck it, being low. Yeah, I came through and I'm swerving on him. Just trying to vibe, so don't be starting nothing. Going up all night with some pretty young things, and you know they're from the west side. On and on and on and on. Going on till the night turns into morning. You know the whip was grown, so I don't see nothing wrong. Bored up, I'm trying to live a little. 
Ain't turning down, not even just a little I might be rolling with you, baby, in a little Top down on the coupe, wanna feel a little Live a little, bored up, I'm trying to live a little Ain't turning down, not even just a little I might be rolling with you, baby, in a little Top down on the coupe, when we live a little, live a little From the window to the wall, we all in Like LeBron and Kobe, that's how we ballin' Tell the neighbors, they might as well come and join Cause it Cause the party don't stop till six in the morning Getting live like it's so five Man, I remember those nights, yeah T-Pain got us so right R. Kelly with the slow wine And you know it goes on and on and on Even just a little I might be rolling with you, baby, in a little Top down on the coop, wanna feel a little Live a little, board up, I'm trying to live a little Live a little Good morning, guys uh, So today is Friday We're just walking over to the hospital now um, We're gonna collect some blood samples for some patients And, um, you have to collect as many blood samples as we can and then we uh, run the ELISA on it to get the protein levels. Yeah, so ELISA is just determining the protein level and that part, like I mentioned earlier, just takes forever. And I realize like lab research is really not for me. Um, I'd rather do like clinical type of research, maybe like clinical trials, things of that nature. But I mean, it is good just getting the experience and like the techniques of being in the lab and doing that kind of stuff. Um, at the hospital surprisingly it is hard to get these malaria samples it's like um, in Accra at the teaching hospital that we're at Kuala Labu, there's not really that many um, malaria cases so we've been forced to like go to other hospitals in the area one hospital um, Dodawa it's about an hour and a half outside of Accra that's one site where we're doing a sample collection and then another hospital called PML is another place we're doing um, collection so I don't know people Obviously, there's a lot of malaria cases in West Africa. I don't know if people are just getting sick and not going to the hospital for to seek medical care, or if um, you know they come and they're just not consenting to do the study because you do obviously have the consent to um, you know give your blood and have it be in this type of study. So that's a challenge. You know, obviously you create a research proposal, you want to do a project, but if you're not getting samples or as many samples as you like, there's not really much you can do. And the previous samples that we did Eliza on, those were already collected before we came here. Like it was collected by um, another student when they came to Accra previously. But we still have time. We still have four more weeks left. So there's plenty of time to um, continue. There's plenty of time to continue to um, collect the samples. So yeah, I'm just sitting at home now. This weekend, we're going to Cape Coast. Um, that's like, obviously everybody knows about the slave trade in West Africa and so Cape Coast is one of the major sites where um, the slave trade was happening so that's one site that people go to and visit so it's about like three hours outside of Accra so we got a hotel and we're just gonna stay there for the weekend and there's also like this canopy type area there so we'll do that so thank you guys for watching again this week and if you enjoyed this vlog please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one Bye.